Hey, I'm a stunner, stunner, summer, summer, been in Hunter, cook up, hey, my cool. This is how you know you had a good workout. Look at my hair. It looks crazy. I look crazy. Oh, this cozy sweater is super oversized. It's like Shepra. It's from Gap. I love this sweater. This is all I wore to the gym because it's so big and bulky. But it's lightweight at the same time. Hello, you guys. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Saturday, and I just got back home from Walmart. And I'm about to make some spaghetti, but I had to get on here so I could put you guys on this candle. This candle, let me see, it's called Cherry Oud by I think Better Homes and Gardens from Walmart. This is a Tom Ford Lost Cherry candle dupe, and it's huge. This literally smells just like Lost Cherry, and it was only, I think like, I think it was $14. Go and get you one. If you like Lost Cherry, go and get you one, two, three, four, or maybe even five. So it's really weird how the subconscious mind works. So last Sunday, we were on our way home from church, right? And my mom made a comment and she was like, oh, I'm gonna make some spaghetti. So for some reason, all this week, I've been craving spaghetti. So like, I went to the store and got all the stuff to make it. I got ground turkey, cause that's what I make mine with. Um, and that's what she makes hers with as well. But I really didn't have spaghetti on my mind at all. Now out of nowhere, I have like this undying craving for spaghetti. So we're gonna get into it and we're gonna make some. And I'll show you guys all the stuff that I add into mine. Um, I like using the ground turkey because it's a lot leaner than using like a ground beef or a ground pork. I don't eat pork. Um, but yeah, if you do, no shade, no tea. I'm just saying I don't. Um, but yeah, I'll show you guys how I make mine and you can incorporate it into your mix if that's something you want to do. Mala mía, si tú estás buscando un mejuego, un día te dejaré mirando hasta el cielo. Mala mía, si tú estás buscando un mejuego, un día te dejaré mirando hasta el cielo. Se pone que tal, que hasta el novio ni lo respeta. Como ella se mueve, siempre hace cosas que no debe. Pa' tu casa y Netflix solo a darle play Era mexicana, me dijiste wey Mejor que mi novio si tu que lo hace Y empezó el contacto, nos fuimos al otro cuarto Tu eres una novata y te haces mami para ser sensato Mami porque a ti te parto, llámame que soy tu gato Yo no te voté porque hermosa en México soy tu gato Se pone coqueta, que hasta el novio ni lo respeta Guys, so today is Saturday. I am headed to brunch to meet up with um, one of my friends, like one of my long, long time friends. We've been friends for super long, probably since ninth grade. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go meet up for brunch. I know I look crazy right now, but hear me out. Just give me a few minutes and I'm gonna get myself together. The fit is very simple. You know how I do it. Um, this is a 
like a satin black button down that's collar from H&M. Pants are from H&M as well. They're black, slight flare at the bottom. Um, I'm taking my um, Hunter Green Telfar pill with me and then I'm wearing these New Balance um, 550s that my brother surprised me with. Like I had been talking and talking to him about these shoes and he's a sneakerhead. So one day he just had the shoes show up at my house and I was so surprised and so grateful and I thought it was super sweet. So since it's raining, it's gonna be a sneaker type of day. I'm gonna try to do something with, with all of this and I will see you guys when we get to the spot. Okay, really quick, uh, the scent of the day is gonna be Dylan Turquoise by Versace. My daughter and her boyfriend got me this for Christmas. Last, I think it was last Christmas. So I'm gonna wear this today. It smells so girly and feminine. And the bottle is really pretty. But yeah, this is the scent of the day. Let's go. Today is Monday. A little bit of time has passed um, since I last recorded. I, I did record a little bit when I went to um, lunch with my friend on, what day was it? Saturday. But we had like a really good time, like to the point where we. <laughs> we ended up like having a couple drinks and like just talking and catching up and we caught up for like hours and hours so yeah just so you can have an idea of how that day went it was pretty awesome i missed her a lot and i was glad that i got to see her but i'm sorry that i got uh, minimal footage anywho today's monday like i said and we are getting ready to do we're getting ready to do i can barely speak and at home workout and I'm literally doing my gym routine even though I'm working out at home I'm still doing my gym routine and I wonder if anybody else does this or is it just me like I don't know it's just something about it it's like I don't feel right unless I'm doing my routine if I know that I'm working out I put on my deodorant this is the Lomi lavender sage 72 hour coverage I think it's um yeah it's aluminum free but i've been using it since before i was pregnant and i loved it so i still use it now um and yeah i'm putting on my lumi i'm getting ready to slick down my hair um for just a little like chill bun which is crazy to some people i guess because i'm literally getting ready like I'm in the gym but for real I'm not um and I have a surprise reveal because well I'm just gonna say this let me just say this remember I said I'm gonna get this baby weight off of me like this is not a game I'm dead serious about getting this weight off so I took some action and hold hold on hold on Totally forgot to tell you guys, this is gonna be the scent of the workout. This is my ride or die tried and true dirty body spray from Lush. Um, I have like bottles of this stuff, excuse me, laying all over my house, like upstairs, downstairs. I have it everywhere cause it's the bomb. I love it, it's a fresh, clean scent. And one thing about me, I'm gonna smell good. Like I don't care what I'm doing, I'm gonna smell good. You can bet that. 
Okay guys, drum roll please. There she is. I bought a Peloton. All right, so the next thing that I'm getting ready to do is connect my headphones. Um, I like to have on my headphones when I'm doing my workout just because it puts me more in the zone. Got my water cup and yeah, we're gonna do a beginner class. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, you guys already know the vibes. If anybody can get me motivated, I'm sorry, but it is Beyonce. Um, so I'm looking for a class that features Beyonce. Um, this is my favorite instructor. Where is she? I'm trying to see. Cause I know she does a lot of Beyonce. Yeah, Tune Day. Hey girl, hey. Tune Day is my favorite Peloton instructor, you guys. So if you think about doing Peloton or getting you one or trying it out, whatever, definitely try one of Tune Day's classes. I don't know, I'm trying to find a class of hers that I haven't taken yet. Cause usually when I get on, if I'm doing like a 20 or 30 minute ride, I'll take her class. Um, I do go back and forth between um, different instructors for my cool down though. Uh, I don't know. Well, let me just look cause this can be tedious and take a while and then I'll come back to you guys. And it looks like Tune Day strikes again, you guys. So I'm getting ready to take this 20 minute class with Tune Day. This is pre-recorded. This is her playlist. It's giving, I'm gonna be turned. Drake, Ariana Grande, Beyonce, Justin Timberlake, Destiny's Child. So, and this is the class plan right here. So I don't know if you guys can see can see it well enough, but three minutes of warm up, 15 minutes and 53 seconds of three movements, and then a minute cool down. So yeah, this should be fun, fun, fun. I'm ready to go. Sometimes it takes a little while for the string to, to get better. She's just basically telling us that we did the hardest part of this by um, joining the class. She's letting us know how to control our resistance. Your resistance is actually controlled by your instructor. So when they say to turn it up or down, it's gonna go up or down automatically.
y'all the class is over it was intense and she got me there per usual disregard with the way my lip my nails look i know they look crazy but yeah tune got me there she swept me out real good and that's what i love about those um quick beginner classes because they're like 20 minutes long so you get your cardio in even if it's late at night like right now it's almost 10 o'clock i think it's like five till so i need to go take a shower obviously because all of this and then i also need to um, make something quick to eat because i'm starving and i haven't had any dinner i usually don't work out with anything on my stomach just because i perform better that way it's just a personal preference but yeah i'm gonna go shower and then hop out and get me something to eat okay you guys so i finally got my late night post-workout snack ready um this is a piece of Dave's I think it's like nine grain but it's sprout bread it's not regular bread some banana slices I don't know why I made some way fatter than the others but anywho and um, some all-natural peanut butter underneath that and then I just sprinkled some cinnamon on it and I am gonna make some tea and go to bed and I'll check back in with you guys tomorrow Hey you guys, today is Tuesday, it's Tuesday night. Work was kind of crazy today, so I didn't have the opportunity, unfortunately, to vlog. Um, I'm hopping on the Peloton again. It's almost like 11 o'clock, it's 1040. I had to cook dinner, run some errands, do some other stuff, um, the baby sleeps. So I'm gonna try to just get like a quick little cardio session because this weight is not gonna lose itself so yeah that's what i'm doing now and another reason i just forgot that i couldn't vlog today i lost my camera charger so it literally is about to die at any minute um i did order another one off of amazon but i'm just waiting for that to come it's supposed to be here tomorrow so hopefully fingers crossed it's here